what's up guys welcome back to the youtube channel man i hope y'all had a good thanksgiving it is the day after turkey day i'm still stuffed we got to spend some much needed time with the family so that was awesome hopefully hopefully you guys had a great thanksgiving as well and ate a lot of turkey a lot of ham we're messing with the race car trailer today we are no prep racing this weekend at thunder valley we're going to be doing back of the track so hopefully it's going to be getting us close for dig or die they do have a little funky launch pad so it's not exactly like dig or die, but we got the car out of here. The golf cart is out of here. We're about to go ahead and try to get the race car in here with the smart car. Coming off Las Vegas, that was amazing. We had a great time at Las Vegas. It was really tiring, but it was so much fun. And Rodney ended up working. It, that thing ended up that thing ended up doing a monster wheel stand first round on Sunday. He had a buy. And their fuel ratio still wasn't quite right, so we're still trying to figure that stuff out. So he didn't make any more passes, but that thing's got potential to go really fast. I had a blast hanging out with Rodney and his crew down there. Man, it was fun. We didn't get to do a lot of talking about updates at Crossville, but Crossville was amazing as well. That was fun, fun, fun. Got down to basically 11 cars, probably went out the pairing we were. I guess technically we were like number eight or number nine uh out of 177 cars so i'm super happy with that the car run good it would have been nice if we could have got that last win against the mak guys but we were able to get a little bit of cash so that was fun all right guys let me show you what we got going on today don't forget to comment like and subscribe and go to turbojohnracing.com i've been out here working on it the back of it has got our normal logo i'm gonna get kelly to show you that uh we got tire covers we got blankets she's got a bunch of stuff she's coming out here and just saying so the other thing we've been working on, man, this thing, the wind just comes through this trailer and it knocks down my banners. I got this awesome Hughes Performance banner and QA1. So we just put some sticky tape. I had some Velcro and this Hughes one is a little bigger. So it was coming down all the time. So we put some double side tape on it along with the Velcro. We did end up having to move our toolbox. It was facing this way, but I faced it this way. And the goal is, is the Mustang is going to slide all the way up here to the front of the trailer. I've got a little bit of work to do back here in the back. Um, it has got a little bit of oil leak on the Mustang. Uh, it's been sitting for two weeks. So I got to fix that. The coin floor is kind of ripped off. It's, I need to push it back over and put some tear downs. The whole floor is kind of moving over the coin floor. So that's kind of a pain in the butt. But uh, a little bit of work. You can see how it's buckling up a little bit. But I need a bigger trailer. <laughs> or I need to do some organizing. That's the biggest thing. I need to get in here and organize, and then that would probably make it a little bit better. But uh, I'm gonna slide the Mustang in first. Mustang's gonna go in first, and then the smart car is gonna go here in the back. If you're on the side of the road, or if you broke down, or if you need to do something, you can unload the smart car first. Um, now, hopefully, the back of the car is gonna be about there. I might end up having to install some more D-rings um, somewhere in this area here to, to bolt the Mustang down. So we'll see that in a second. We might have to do that today too. But overall, man, I think it should work out okay. Let me show you what we got. The golf car is gonna be for sale as well. There's a little smart car. Hi. So Kelly made us a tire cover. Oh, that's big. It's actually not much bigger than yours. It's the same width as yours. It's just a little longer. Oh. But your magnets are a little worn out. So when our magnets get in. It's going to be about perfect. Yeah, it'll be better. Our magnets are going to be um, heavier than these ones. So it should, it should be about perfect. All right. So we got some tire covers. That's also a good banner if you don't want to use it for a tire cover. Yeah. I mean, that'll work out good. What else did you get, Kelly? Let's see. We've got some new hoodies. We've got some long sleeve t-shirts. Uh, a blanket, a Turbo John blanket, which is the most fuzziest, most comfiest thing in the world. Um, and the tire covers. All on TurboJohnRacing.com. I think there's a deal going on too, right? What is it? There's Cy a Black Friday deal through Cyber Monday where if you buy, there's a deal on the tire covers and the banners. They're both on discount. And we'll have John sign them in a gold marker right here um, before we send them off to oh, you. Oh, that'll be cool. And if you are a channel member, you also get a discount on the hoodies, a 10% discount, and the code, you can only see it if you're a channel member, and you go to the uh, community tab on John's YouTube channel, you'll see the code to get 10% off your Turbo John hoodie. Oh, that's a good deal. Cool! So, you mean my Nitrous Express, I, I don't have to use it anymore? No, the, we, should, we should give it a, like a little, we should give it a little off. Here. Look, it has, been, it has been welded on, and it has been... It is being. It's not that much smaller than the Turbo John. There's like an inch. Yes, yeah, a couple inches off the, yeah. I think, on the bottom. Maybe one inch. 
But this thing is like it is beat up. That was the it cheapest is. one I could find on Summit's website, like back in the day. You, yeah. you know what I to do? I to give that away to somebody. Oh yeah, you could sign that and give it away. Yeah, we'll sign that and give it away. Do you want to pick? We'll have some people comment on this post. Yeah, everybody comment on this post, and then uh, we'll pick a winner after Cyber Monday. Yeah, that'll work. We'll and pick you'll a, get this awesome. Comment signed. that you want. Comment that you want the. Yeah. <laughs> the not you want the old tire cover. Because <laughs> you if you don't want it and you get picked, that's not going to work out probably. They're going to be like, why did I get this piece of crap? Look, it's been welded on. That's probably when, I think that's when I caught the car on it's fire. still got plenty of use. Wait, it's the car fire. <laughs> yeah, yeah, in the garage. When I was, uh, I didn't tell you about that. I was, one of the time, one of the times it was in the garage, I was welding on it in like our garage here at the house. Oh. So our house, I was welding on it. Yeah, and why didn't you tell us? That's stuff you don't share. <laughs> I, I'm going to edit that out of the video. I'm not going to share that. No. 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 <laughs> Keep this in. But yeah, so um, yeah, that was one of the times I was like, I smell smoke. And uh, yeah, it was smoking. So now we got this amount of room. Check out the hoodie, guys, in the back. That's the vintage look. Pick up your hood. Oh, my bad. There you go. How's that look? <laughs> oh, that feels good. It looks good. It is freaking cold out here. This is chilly. Although it wasn't as cold as it was in Las Vegas. Or Tennessee. Yeah, ten no, God, Tennessee. Ooh, it was cold. Okay, so this is, uh, I think there's, I mean, there's enough room. We're fixing to try it now. You can pull up a couple more inches. Okay. Is the car, does the car move at all when the trailer moves? Does it need to have a little play so it doesn't hit the smart car? It's got a cut of two or three inches between the um, parachute and the smart car. And I might have to take the parachute off. Yeah, that uh, might. Yeah, I'm going to need to. Because that's a whole, like, good foot and yeah, a half. Yeah, the parachute's going to have to come off while we're traveling, which is fine. That is not that big a deal. And then that way it will give us a solid, that will give us another. I mean, that is in there. Yep. I mean, that's where it'll be. But I think, I think it'll be better uh, with the parachute off. God, it barely fits. I need a bigger trailer. No. <laughs> I need a stacker. <laughs> what? You need to have this trailer for longer. Okay, I, okay. I agree. I mean, we had another one pretty long. <laughs> Here All right, let's see. Let, yes, that's exactly yes. what we need. So we do need one. It fits, but it barely fits. But it does fit. So yeah, we'll, we're we're going to take the. Uh, I mean, that'll give us another foot and a half, and then I can even not pull the the race car up quite so far. Um, the other thing I may do is take the one of my tie downs and tie it. Put me a tie down spot. Off of the off of the bumper back here instead of off the rear end, that might work good too. Okay, well that works. It fits. Uh, I mean, it definitely. I don't have as much room as you know with the golf cart. I mean, the smart car is not a ton bigger, but it is a little bigger. I can move it over a little this way just to give us more room over here on this side. Oh, that fell on my door. That's not good. Okay. So, yeah, I think that's what we'll do is we'll move it over and then we'll be good to go. And we're going to have a golf cart for sale, too. The golf cart is for sale. The golf cart, let me know. It runs. It is smoking a little bit, burning a little bit of oil, so it's just got a Harbor Freight motor on it. Y'all hit me up. Come see us at Thunder Valley Saturday. 
we'll be there. Uh, comment, like, and subscribe. Dig or die is happening next weekend. All right, guys, later.